Hey everyone, today we're going to be looking at how to install aluminium mesh on a tile roof. The method we're going to be using is slipping the aluminium mesh underneath the row of second tiles. The tools you're going to need are a drill, a quarter inch nut setter and a pair of tin snips. Let's have a look how to install it. The first thing we're going to do is tack our mesh into position and then roll the mesh out along this stretch of roof. Then we're going to put the gutter trims on. We're putting in a screw into the first position of the gutter trim. And then we're going to put a screw in the final position. That's going to help us get it all set up so that we can go and put the remaining screws in the middle. Then just continue this along the edge of roof. Just butt each of the gutter trims up next to each other. They don't have to overlap. Next, we're going to cut the mesh about an inch higher than that second row of tiles because we're going to be slotting the mesh underneath so we do want a little bit there so that it bites under, but we don't want too much, otherwise it's going to make it a little bit difficult to push the mesh underneath. Then we're going to come through and we're going to make a slit in line with the edge of the tiles. You want that slit to come down pretty much to the edge of that second row. And I'll show you why in a sec as we go to wedge that mesh underneath the tile. Now you can see we're going to pry up the tile and then you can see how that slot or that slit we've made in that mesh is going to come in handy. So we've got that tile lifted up just a tiny bit, but because we've got that slit in there, we're able to push under just that section of mesh. That's going to make it really easy to work our way along because you're only going to want to lift up one tile at a time. Be really careful when you lift the tiles up. Uh, you only want to lift it up ever so slightly, just enough to get the mesh under. You can see now that we're slotting that mesh under, we're getting a nice flat flush finish. Now note that we've got a pretty flat tile here. You might have a tile which is far more sculpted than this. So what you might have to do is really, you might have to massage that mesh a little bit just to get it to conform to the shape of those tiles just a little bit more. The mesh is pretty pliable, it's aluminium. Uh, as you press it down, you'll be able to wedge it into each of the nooks and crannies. And that's how the installation looks when it's finished. Nice and flat, especially with our flat tiles here. It's pretty straightforward and there's not many tools needed to do the job.